while drawing a parallel with dt's is it right understanding that images photographs of dt's can be compared to recorded sound of our chant when chanted attentively now why recorded sound the photograph of the dt is an expansion of the dt let's say radha krishna chandra is worshiped by many congregation in this temple of this temple in their homes then because they are devotees of this lord and they are offering everything in their house to the lord and they are worshiping the lord their house lord is radha krishna chandra there is radha krishna chandra expands into that picture and that picture is non different from the deity if the proper vidhi is followed this is important in the temple what happens because the acharya is invited directly the deities and it's a public place even if some shortcomings are there should not be there if it is there also he will manifest he doesn't go away once he has installed he goes away this temple is he does not go away at all but in a picture or let us say i have this i have this rosewood krishna here this rosewood krishna has been with me since 19 80 uh, 81 onwards in different places so now this krishna is not installed but when the devotee looks at that krishna at that time krishna manifests in there there is bhakti but otherwise there is no there is no discipline there is no offering to this vigraha all those things so why should he stay there he doesn't reside in this so a picture of the deity is same as the deity 